I'm Dr. Killian de Gascon. I'm Director of the National Biofressing Authority at UCD and I'm Chair of the Expert Advisory Group to the National Public Health Emergency Team in the Department of Health. So NEFID is the National Public Health Emergency Team in the Department of Health and the Expert Advisory Group is a subgroup that feeds into NEFID. So the importance of coordinating between public health representatives and politicians is to ensure that these consistent messages going out from the government and from the public health specialists to the people of Ireland because in essence we're only going to be able to control this crisis and get through this crisis if we're all pulling in the same direction. Our role is to provide the best public health advice and then the government takes that on board and they think of the bigger picture in the context of the economy, societal health and all of the other aspects but our priority from an EAG and NEFA perspective is to focus on the public health. So at this point in time, people will be aware that we don't have a vaccine for SARS-CoV-2 and we don't have an effective antiviral therapy. So the priority for us then, the only way we can control this infection is to identify every case, to isolate those individuals that are infected and then to trace their contacts and to make sure that the infection hasn't spread any wider. So testing is a, is a really important part of that process because at this stage, the physical distancing measures with, pe with which people will be familiar are the only means we have of controlling the spread of the virus in the community. I think it's really important at this stage of the epidemic to acknowledge the effort that the people of Ireland has made as a community and as a society. Because a few weeks back, we saw a significant increase in the number of cases in hospitals, significant increase in the number of cases in intensive care. And over the last five weeks, with compliance and adherence and cooperation from society and from the community, we've been able to flatten that curve and we've been able to reduce those numbers. We can't do this by ourselves. We need people to work with us. And in essence, as a society and a community, we will have to do this together.